Hey folks, my name is Travis Osborne. Welcome back to Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. In the previous episode, we started the first half of World 2. And in today's episode, we're going to be completing World 2, which is Autumn Heights. I should have probably said that earlier, but that's besides the point where we're going to roll with it. If you guys have been enjoying this series, please leave a like on the video. Comment, subscribe, do all that cool stuff. And yeah, you may notice in this video that the audio is actually a lot better. This is one of my first brand new recordings on my new PC, which I am super stoked about. So yeah, let me know what you think of the audio and if there's some things that you want to have adjusted. I know that the like maybe the capture card audio that's coming through with like the music of the game is not like totally on par, but let me know what you think about that in the comments. If I could turn it up just a little bit, that would be fantastic. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and start with 2B. This is going to be Rodent Ruckus. And yeah, we'll be completing World 2 in this episode and then moving on into the next world, which is really exciting. I'm, I will say, I might talk about this quite a bit this episode, but I am so excited that I have a... Uh, a brand new um brand new computer and it's not actually a pc it's a mac uh, what a m amazing jump there um i decided to go to a mac because uh awesome just awesome <coughs> because i actually own a ton of apple products and I, wow, how did I not die there? That's actually really impressive. Um, and yeah, I've been, I've been like, if everything with like Apple works really well together and Apple has in the re last few years has gone and really up their, um, up their game quite a bit when it comes to like video recording and editing so i i went with a brand new um macbook air and uh there's a way you could actually blow if i remember correctly but i don't exactly remember how to do that in this game however this is one of these first levels that we're going to be doing my controller is out of place i got do you hear this popping sound um, that's basically my controller's joystick. It, I have to get a new controller at some point in time. Yeah, we have one of the first barrel levels here. Um, I'm not particularly that great with these levels. These are actually some of my least favorite levels typically in the game because, uh, it feels, they, they usually feel a little finicky to me. Like I like I like the minecart levels, but these are the like the levels that really I've never been overly fond of. Like they're creative, don't get me wrong, but um, they're just they're just not my cup of tea. Oh, holy cow! How did I like? How did I actually end up getting that end there? That was insane. But like the concept of this level is really creative. What was that? Grab that heart, yeah. Okay. Nope. Dang. That really sucks. I was trying to get that uh, G there and I just totally like, I totally missed it. Yeah, this is a, this is a rather short one of these levels, which I'm okay with. Like, oh, I, just honestly, I just did not see that there, which is 
pretty bad of me, actually. Alright, I think we want to just stay right down the middle. There we go. Got all the letters. The barrel's gonna run out of juice. And... Dang it. Mistimed that just a bit. Yeah. <coughs> I'm glad to be bringing you guys brand new episodes for my new Mac. I I hope you guys do like the new production quality with it. There is gonna be probably sometimes some more editing work that's done, which is a little frustrating, but I'm not gonna complain about it too much. Anyway, we don't wanna go into 2.6 quite yet. I think we definitely want to go into 2.5 before we do 2.6. So let's move on into Alpine Incline. Yeah, I've been really enjoying this series again, and it it feels so cool to be playing a, um, a Donkey Kong game again. And I mentioned this in a previous episode, like... Nintendo is really due up for a new Donkey Kong game. Um, I And I honestly do believe that. Um, like, th this is... This game is... Just as old as, like, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, which is... Kind of insane... To think about, like... Like... We, we've been talking about how Nintendo's needed a new Mario Kart game. Like, they are due up for a uh, new Donkey Kong game, too. So, I hope that they're... I'm, I'm really hoping that they've been working on something. Because... That sounds like a lot of fun to play a brand new Donkey Kong game. Let's try to get all the nanas, huh? There we go. Nice checkpoint. Common, we're going to the left. Let's go. And yeah, you get all the nanas, you get a puzzle piece. We'll chuck that. Yeah, I... But yeah, we're getting into the, um... I believe the boss fight of this world is actually, like, pretty difficult, so... We're getting to the parts of the game where it's gonna start being challenging, like... I've been kind of been... I've been kind of making this look easy for a bit. And... You can only make it look so easy for so long. Give that to me. There we go. Um, so, I'm definitely going to say that. Like, it's going to get pretty hard here soon. So, I am definitely ready for this challenge. Like... And that's kind of like how I want to end the year. Like, kind of mentioned this in a previous video, but like, the game is challenging in such a good way. Like, I definitely want to end the year with um, this incredible game because I've been enjoying the challenging platformers. Am I gonna make that? I am. I was actually nervous that I wasn't going to make be making that. Ah, uh, didn't get that banana coin. It's okay. Um, nice checkpoint. Let's go. Look at that. That's extremely satisfying right there. I will say there is something about these Donkey Kong games that are like actually pretty satisfying. When you do stuff like that, um, 
like collecting all the bananas and uh, yeah I wasn't gonna I don't think I was gonna make that very easy for myself now was I had a couple short levels to begin this I forgot I actually didn't realize how short this was okay are we how are we gonna get this DK like this BAM 14 nanas 14 banana coins let's go love to see it I have a laggy loading screen there from my switch that's kind of weird all right Continuing on, we're going to move on to 2-6. This is Wingding. Yeah, I definitely feel like right now, like, the first half of these episodes are definitely... Or, first half of these worlds are going to be much longer. But, um... As, as we keep going, um... They're going to definitely be, a. Uh, they're definitely going to get much, much harder, and I mean that. Now, what is this way? Nice. Ah! Tricky. Alright, this is kind of a fun stage. I do remember this one actually giving me some trouble, though, so... But yeah, the idea behind this stage is roll the, or do, use the bells and um, ring the bells, and you're able to uh, go into the next part. So you you really want to like. You really want to like. Ring the bell so you can get like all the cool like fun secrets and that if you do it right you're able to get like a bunch of puzzle pieces for it too. I'm gonna take this guy. Yeah, there's something up here, right? I gotta be honest, it's like actually a, a pretty hidden, like, um, spot. And I hope my mic is not actually picking that up, because I just realized, like, I didn't close my door while I started, like, my, uh, dishwasher and laundry. So, uh, that's actually very, very funny. If you guys could hear that, so... Usually my mic doesn't actually pick up that far, but... Not gonna lie, that that kind of stuff is really loud in this house, so... I messed up a little bit here, but like... Oh... That was not very good. Now was it? That was actually pretty bad. Get out of here. All right, let's time that jump a little better. Yeah, I believe that some of these won't show up unless if you ring the bell. Nice. Checkpoint. I'm gonna break through here. Give me that extra life. Gold Dixie. Oh my. 
That was potentially one of the most embarrassing things ever. What's down there? I'm super curious right now. Yeah, I, I noticed that there were some platforms over there. Okay, cool. These ones are really difficult, yeah. I think this is the first time we're getting this one, yeah. Whew! Yeah, like, controlling your momentum through the air there? Yeah, it's, pr it's pretty tough. Um, let's go. Nice. Oh, yeah. The, these ends, man, I'm telling you. Like, getting the end letters are always, like, the most difficult for me. Like, I think they do that on purpose. Does this lead to a puzzle piece? Nah. Not that generous, Nintendo. How did I not take damage there? Speaking of not taking damage... What? You didn't grab onto the vine. That, that sucks. Well... Oh well, I'm not getting a bit. I thought I missed that. Yeah, this is for sure the most difficult stage we've played so far. Nice. Oh my lord. Nice checkpoint. Dude, that's just super epic looking. It's... Like, if you were just to clip that, which I will, um... That's, like, the thing that makes... Donkey Kong game so cool. And honestly, some of Nintendo's like better game. Okay. I believe you do it like this, right? We still got quite a bit left of this stage. Okay, we gotta get moving. You suck. <laughs> Get the G. Oh, that was just horribly timed. Yeah, that's probably the most difficult stage we've played so far. Um, I don't know where that last puzzle piece is. Huh. <coughs> Unless if I just, like, totally missed it. I apologize if you hear it coughing. Like, I'm still getting over, like, kind of a nasty flu. And that there is the K stage that we will be doing in a future episode. Now we're going to go on to Mountaintop Tussle. This boss is pretty tough, um, if I remember correctly. So, we definitely may be here a bit. Um, and I will say that with some certainty.
Okay. So. So yeah, we're gonna want to really be careful in this fight. Because this fight is, oh. I believe the way to do this is... Like, something like that, right? Um, and yeah, this is... This is a boss fight where we want to try to keep Dixie as long as possible. Because... Because, like, it actually does get very, very tricky. Get hit, bro. Because we're it's going to progressively get more tough. I believe there's actually a way you could hit the owl here. Got him. I wasn't thinking like that, but like... I'm gonna have to really focus, because I actually forgot, like, this is re This is actually really tough. Got him. It's actually really nice. Come here. Got him. Nice. Okay, now this is a phase where I want to be able to take some kind of damage. Like, I obviously don't want to take damage at all, but, like... Okay, watch out here. Go here. Nice. Then move here. I missed. Good. What are we doing here? Oh! Nice. Come here. Whoa, I went the wrong way for a minute. Whew. Nice! First shot! Dude, I have not ever done that on the first try. That is actually a really tough boss. Normally, I'm actually blown away that I did that on the first go.
And that probably could be the fact, like, I have played through this game before. I've never 100 percent it before. But man, oh wow, that felt actually good. That was impressive. <laughs> Travis, that was amazing! Uh, well, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this, of course, leave a like on the video. Leave a like for that, like, first shot. That was awesome. But yeah, that was the completion of uh, Autumn Heights. In the next episode, we're going to be moving on into Bright Savannah. So, yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, of course, leave a like on the video. And subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any future content. Thank you all so much for watching. And until next time, I will see you all later.